this is Tom here in Panel Processing with another two second lean improvement. So we have these binders here at Como 1 and Como 2 that show us all of our MDF door styles. So for training purposes and just uh, for referencing, uh, when we do a specific style of door and we're unfamiliar with the tooling, we got to grab this binder open it up, find the page that we're looking for, and say, okay, here I've got 740s, and here is my list of tools that I need for that specific kind of door. And each kind of door varies a little bit, you know. So, um, I find that there's a lot of wasted time and wasted motion in this process, so it was suggested to me to make an improvement. So I'll be back in my second video. I'm back with a second part of my two second lean video. So I took my project home with me to do some work there. So I got a spreadsheet on the computer and I listed out all of our different processes and along the top of it I just listed the tools that we keep in our carousel for these processes and it varied a little bit from melamine processes to door processes. And I just listed them all as they were required for each process. Problem with this was that, you know, just looking at it, it's kind of small. It's not really easy for somebody new to, to understand it. So, I'll be back with part three of this project. All right, here I am, part three of my two-second lean improvement. Here it is, the final product for Como 1 and Como 2. We have a nice colored laminated display of all of our processes and all of our tools. So, as you can see, the squares that are in the light gray color are the tools that are common, the ones that we always use, the ones that are marked NA for non-applicable, those spots don't really matter to the process, and the particulars, the ones in orange, are ones that are specific to a certain process. So, say for pull-out shelves, when we do charcoal pull-out shelves, we have to have the 5-8 cutter in tool slot number three. It's important. Down here under doors, say if we're doing 830s and 831s, it's important to have these tools in those slots. Very important. It's a very good uh, quick reference guide here. You don't have to go through a binder wasting that time, wasting that motion, wasting that potential. I want to thank Aaron from Como2 for suggesting this to me. Um, personally, I want to thank my wife and my cousin for helping me out with the spreadsheeting at home. And also, I need to thank Mary Redekop for putting the final touches on this thing, putting color on it and laminating it for me. All right, thank you.